hello everyone thank you so much for clicking on today's video welcome back to ziki's kitchen you guys today i'm going to share with you a quick and easy recipe i'm going to share with you how i achieved this delicious cabbage rice you can see it came out so good it's so colorful take a look at this every ingredient is so fresh and retain the nutrient but you guys let me share with you the ingredients i have for this recipe you can add more you can choose you can but the basic ingredients here is the cabbage so yeah i have mixed spices you know every spices that you can use to spice up the chicken the meat go ahead and add that so here i am using the drumstick so yeah you guys let's get into this video so in into the pot i add the meat then after that i will add all the spices starting with the onions and all the spices that i have there i have rosemary i have thyme i have uh, curry powder i have uh, pepper salt seasoning powder garlic powder so add everything all the spices that you want okay so go ahead and mix everything we are going to start cooking immediately if you want you can go ahead and marinate it so i add about one cup of water cover it and let it cook so while it's cooking we're going to you know prep our vegetable slice the cabbage the onions the carrot the green onions and the peppers okay so after 15 minutes the chicken is ready because this is soft chicken we're going to take it out add it to the oven and then grill the chicken if you want you can go ahead and fry it so i'm going to sieve the juice that i got from the meats because i don't want all these uh, particles in it but if you want you can just you know add everything into the pot but i want the rice to be plain okay so right now into the pot i'm going to add a butter i am using butter and um extra virgin olive oil i didn't know why it, it did not show here but i use a little bit of oil and uh, extra virgin olive oil so yeah i'm going to fry this rice a little bit <laughs> well just go ahead and fry it but if you just want add the water and then i just feel like let me you know fry the rice a little bit then after that add the water we got from the chicken which is the chicken stock and then uh, Add a little bit of seasoning powder, salt. Make sure you test for salt before you add more. So cover it, let it cook for 25 minutes until it's ready. So right now, this is what we have. The rice is soft. If you want, you can still cook it, but just cook it to your desired preference, okay? So yeah, after that, I'm going to add a little bit of oil and also extra virgin olive oil no butter and extra virgin olive oil so go ahead and mix all of them together now we are going to make the rice as you guys see it's so so easy i add my garlic and ginger then after that i'll add the onions we're going to stir fry this for just two minutes you know so because we're doing just stir fry all the vegetables so i add the carrot then we're going to stir fry the carrot for another two minutes we want this to be crunchy we want all the vegetables especially the carrots and the cabbage to be crunchy so after about just a minute i add the peppers okay if you don't have any of this just do with basic ingredients which is the cabbage okay so once you add the cabbage do not overstay just one minute is okay because we want it crunchy okay so after adding the cabbage mix everything together we are going to add a little bit of adobe seasoning because we want to make sure that it is tasty okay so add a little bit of that go ahead and give it a quick stir then after that we are going to add our rice you do not want to cook it so add the rice and then mix everything together so i figured out that i have mixed vegetable i have peas i have green beans and a little bit of corn so i just you know add that but if you don't have that that's okay so make do with what you have in your kitchen but make sure that you have cabbage okay so after that we are going to add our spring onions you guys our rice is ready to be served let me tell you what happened i decided to try out this recipe for my family they ended up loving it as i'm talking to you right now this rice is finished so if you enjoyed this recipe let me know what you think in the comment section are you going to try it it came out so delicious it came out so colorful and it is so crunchy so this is what we made for lunch. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Have a beautiful day. Bye.